I'm going to teach you how to create single use coupon codes for your promotions um, and giveaways in order to launch your product onto the first page. All right, so this is very important. They understand kind of how to create the right type of promotion um, in Amazon and you don't do this incorrectly. There have been sellers who have um, lost a huge percent of their inventory overnight when they um, use promotion codes incorrectly. So that's why I'm kind of dedicating this video specifically to this topic. And unfortunately, Amazon makes it a little bit complicated to create coupon codes and promotion codes. At least in my opinion, it's more complicated than it should be. But overall, it'll be very simple um, when you follow these steps. So I'll go ahead and get into it. The first thing you want to do is log into your Amazon Seller Central account like I've done here. And then once you're here, go over to advertising and under advertising, click on promotions. All right. And then in promotions, we are going to go to manage product selection. That's the first thing you want to click is manage product selection and then click on create product selection. So this will be brand new on for product selection type, click on ASIN list and then click create product selection. Okay. And then for this, in this case, what I recommend is 70, 80 or 90% off codes. I find the best results with 90% off. So I'm going to go ahead and put 90, 90 off. Um, and then your product, product name, if I can do that product name, there we go. And then just copy that here. Um, and then, okay. So this is just the name It's internal. No one's going to see this. This is just for you. So I like to keep track and put 90 off and then whatever particular product I have. Um, and then for here, ASIN list, you'll want to add the ASIN of the product that you want to um, coupon or discount. So the way that you find that ASIN is you head over here. So you can go over here to inventory and then manage inventory. And then I like to open this in a new tab. So open manage inventory in a new tab. And if you don't already have, you know, your ASINs uh, memorized or copied somewhere else, you can go through and let's just assume this is the product that we want to promote or that we want the promotion to apply to. So the ASIN code is below the title. When you, when you have kind of the Amazon seller um, page and then you go to inventory, manage inventory, then um, the ASIN is the gray text located right below the title. So you can go ahead and copy that and then add that here to the ASIN list. Now, if you want this 90% off coupon to apply to multiple products, you can go ahead and enter in multiple um, ASINs. But for now, we're just gonna do one. And since I'm not gonna create a new uh, promotion, I'm not gonna hit submit, but you would go ahead and hit submit there. Uh, once that's done, go ahead and go back to advertising and then promotions, okay? And then you want to go to um, create a promotion. All right. So we'll go. So in this case, all right, like I said, I, rec I recommend 70 or 90% off, particularly I think 90% off works best. So go to percent off, hit create, leave that at least this quantity of items one. So leave it at one. Um, and then under here, under purchased items, you'll select the code that you just, the, um, you know, that tracking information that you just created, right? The 90 off and um, then product name. So we'll go ahead. They'll say that's 90 off product name. Um, buyer gets percent off. We'll put 90% off applies to uh, purchased items. That's good. You'll set a start and end date of when you want this to run. I recommend at least one week, um, if not two weeks. So I usually leave it just as two weeks, just in case. Um, and so I don't have to go through and create another kind of promotion. So two week period and uh, the key here too is, so obviously you see the time here is in Pacific time. You want to uh, make sure that your um, promotion starts at least four hours after you create it here. Otherwise it won't run. It takes four hours to get everything set up. So, you know, if you're making this at, let's say like noon, make sure that it's um, scheduled for at least 4 p.m. or 5 p.m. or later um, to ensure that it's going to run successfully. Okay. So it takes four hours to kind of get up and running. Just want to let you know that. Uh, so you select the beginning and end time. You can make it, you know, for a full kind of two week period. And then for internal description, I still do, you know, 90 off product name, tr uh, tracking ID. Let's do that. Not that it matters. Um, tracking ID, same thing. Just copy and paste. Keep everything kind of consistent. That's personally what I do. Really doesn't matter as much. Uh, and then here you want to click on for claim code. You want single use. You don't want this going viral. And then a ton of people using this promotion, buying up all your inventory. Okay. So that's very highlight this point right here. 
uh, you want to click on single use you want them to, they can only use it one time one redemption per customer yes leave that checked um and then obviously and then i'll show you kind of how to generate the codes in a second uh then for claim code um combinality we want it to be exclusive right so people aren't using or combining multiple claim codes so we'll leave that at exclusive we'll hit review and if you have anything over 70 percent as you can see here um you'll, you'll just have to you know validate and hit submit so you can go ahead and just um hit submit if everything looks good and again i won't because i'm not creating a new promotion but um so you go ahead and hit submit and then again so this is the last time okay go back to advertising and then promotions and then now you'll go to the center tab here manage your promotions okay and then in your case it'll probably if you're doing this immediately it'll probably be under the pending section um i'll just go back to some expired promotions that i've done before so you'll go to the pending section or the active section and then scroll over to the right of the corresponding kind of um promotion that you're that you want to kind of edit or that you want to generate um coupon codes for click on view all right and then in this case right because i created this um before i can't create new um this is this is expired i can't create new kind of coupon codes so what you'll do is you'll go up here to manage claim codes all right then you're going to have the option um down here to um download a certain number of codes right you it's really up to you to how much to create so what i recommend doing is um again looking at that number right of how many you that, that sales velocity number how many you, you need to sell every day for one week to two week period to rank on page one um and i would do i would i would take that number round up and then multiply that by 14 and that's how many codes that i would download so it could look like 150 or 200 or whatever just to have enough to be safe um but you could really download as many as you want so you'll just enter in that number and like i said i can't do that here because i've already kind of it's already hit expired um but you'll create um you know you'll you'll enter in the number of codes that you want to download go ahead and hit create and then download and what will happen is uh you'll download a i believe it's a text file or a csv file just a file of 200 and look, for example if i put in 200 then i would get 200 150 uh, if i put in 150 i get 150 out right very simple so let's say i put in you know 200 and hit download so that will create 200 unique codes that i can use and it's going to be in the form of a like i said it's a text or a csv file and all you'll do once you have that file is you'll copy you know when you're re if you're reaching out to friends and family if you're reaching out to facebook groups and and uh direct messaging on instagram then what you'll do is take that code so you have the super your you know the, the super url paste that into your message and then give them one of those codes so they can use that code one time they, if they share it it doesn't matter right to where other people it, it once it gets redeemed redeemed one time that's it right they, it can't be uh, multiple times which is obviously good it's a benefit to you so um so yeah you want to just basically go back to that list copy a code paste it in with the super url um to the person that you're messaging and then that allows them to be able to use the code um uh you know to to visit your listing um and when they make that purchase you'll be able to rank for those particular keywords and they'll be able to use that single use coupon code um and it's going to you know protect your inventory and only you know it'll help you only give away as much as you need and not all of your stock like some sellers have experienced and um yeah it's pretty straightforward i'll also show you how to use this list specifically for facebook ads it's actually facebook has ha, has a new feature that allows you to um upload a csv file of uh coupon codes and it automatically kind of dispenses one code at a time per unique customer uh which is really 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 great specifically for amazon um selling and amazon giveaways and i'll show you how to do that in a later video but for now hopefully this is helpful if you have any questions be sure to let me know uh and i look forward to seeing you in the next video